Hey loves and welcome to my channel. Today we are going to talk about Shaga Mushrooms. Shaga Mushrooms is a mushroom that is derived from a fungi that comes directly out of the birch tree and a couple of other different trees. In this video we are going to talk about all of the amazing properties of Shaga Mushroom Powder and how you can use it to reverse so many different things, so many different forms of inflammation and even use it to reboot cells within your body's own. Now it's found on the birch of on the barks of birch on the bark of birch trees and it is really really normally found in colder climates so we're talking europe siberia russia siberia russia and canada and the northern united states of america now shaka mushrooms has a really weird irregular pattern and an irregular shape it is not when we say mushrooms it's not like the normal mushrooms that you think of because like i said it is kind of sort of like a, like a fungi or like a parasite of the tree of the birch tree and it like oozes out and then it creates this like crusty like black bark it's either like a like a black or like a dark brown and then under it you can see it for you can see the shaga format you see the formation under it of a lighter brown like golden color underneath when we're talking about shaga mushrooms it is not something that is really really easy Easy to find all right you can only harvest it at a certain time of the year and it takes a really long time for it to get ready like shaga mushrooms are not going to be ready in a couple of months like a couple of months it takes years for the shaga to form and be ready to harvest and for that reason the only way that you can really get the only way that you can really get shaga is if you find if you find it wildly harvested. So within Simple Apothecary, we have wild harvested shaga mushroom powder. But let's keep breaking it down, all right? Because it is really, really important that you get it at the right time. Now, you can grow it a little bit at home with some of its spores, but it's a really different process from growing regular mushrooms in your house. And it's not going to have all of those benefits all of the same benefits so let's hop into those they contain really really dope compounds like melanin polyphenols beta glucans and a couple of other things and we're going to break all of those down right now polysaccharides now polysaccharides are really really dope and shaga mushrooms are full of them these are complex carbohydrates made up of multiple sugar molecules these polysaccharides give your body the ability to modulate your immune system so it's really really strengthening your immune system making it easier for your body to fight off diseases and infections these compounds interact with the immune system causing it to be responsive to certain stimuli meaning like it's going to make your immune system more reactive like faster at getting diseases so it's like stopping disease and any type of anything at the door beta glucans are a type of polysaccharides. Now these are specifically in a linear chain of glucose molecules that literally keep everything together. Shaga mushrooms are known for their beta glucan content. Beta glucans are believed to stimulate your immune cells such as these natural killer cells within your body that really really aid the body against fighting infections before they ever start. So this right here is your powerhouse and the beta glucans within shaga mushrooms is the ultimate like jump start it's like doo -doo -doo -doo. Now, polyphenols polyphenols are a group of natural compounds and antioxidants found in plants shaga mushrooms aids the body in neutralizing free radicals that can lead to oxidative stress and disease within the body melanin what is melanin we all know what melanin is melanin is the natural pigment that lives in everybody's body of all races and melanin is responsible for the color of your skin your hair and your eyes in mushrooms it contributes to its dark color so the dark black color the dark brown color is melanin that's what you're seeing in that shaga mushroom baby melanin 
antioxidant and UV protection. Now, this melanin within shaga mushroom does that. It serves as a natural antioxidant, contributing to shaga mushrooms overall antioxidant rich properties. But additionally, the melanin within shaga mushrooms aids the body in naturally protecting itself against UV radiation. Now, in Siberian, add it to like your milk. You can add it to like a, a shake or a smoothie. Uh, Microphages are the killer cells within your immune system, right? And a lot of times, if you have different forms of inflammation or if you have any type of free radicals, too many free radicals, any type of oxidative stress within the body, what happens is the killer cells within your body that attack any virus and bacteria, they may be slowed down. They may be really, really weak or they just may not be in abundance. But what is so freaking amazing about chaga mushroom powder, it literally doubles them up. It like shocks them and activates all of the killer cells within your body. So this way you'll end up killing all of the bacteria, all of the overabundance of that bacteria. And as a result, you end up balancing out your healthy, your, your good and bad gut bacteria. A lot of people don't understand that your hair, skin and nails is not created with a hair product or anything like that. Healthy hair, skin and nails are created within the gut. Why? It's something called biotin, but that biotin isn't in the outside source. That biotin is produced within your gut. And through you processing healthy fruits and vegetables and having a balance of good bacteria and bad bacteria within the gut, what happens is your body is able to produce more more hair more biotin which in return helps to helps your body to produce healthy hair skin and nails but again if you have different forms of inflammation and if there are different things going on within the body unchecked then what is going to happen is you will end up having multiple scalp and hair shaft disorders you will end up having multiple outbreaks in with your skin inflammation and you'll also notice that your nails will end up looking weaker these are all different signs that you have something going on inside within the seven day challenge we talk about this all the time like if you see if your hair is itching if your scalp is burning you do not need to go looking for a product you need to wash your hair right and if you are feeling that everything that you're doing on the outside is good then that means that it's time to go inside and start trying to regulate some of these things so these are all things that I really want you to think about and why I think shaga mushrooms are are an amazing addition to anybody's diet because it really modulates your immune system and makes your body strong enough to fight off all of those microorganisms or all of those free radicals that can be causing oxidative stress that could be leading to balding and not just balding like it doesn't even have to have anything to do with hair skin and nails it's just any disease because one thing that we also need to remember is when it comes to a disease Disease, right a disease first started with a trigger something triggered inflammation and after so much inflammation it turned into some type of disease and disorder or some type of illness so if you can reverse everything then you can begin to modulate all of the symptoms that you're having and you can reverse them because most of the time the only thing that is happening is you have too much bad bacteria and not enough good so it's not a good balance, right? So this is why it's really, really important for you to make sure that you have the type of diet or the different additions that you can add to your diet to make sure that the things that you are putting inside of the body allow for the inner workings of your body on the outside to give you the results that you want to see on the outside because healthy hair, skin, and nails start on the inside, right? And if we go from the inside out, not the outside in, and it's so important to remember. In ancient Siberia, it was a regular part of their diet, right? They were always ingesting shaga mushrooms because when my immune system is powered up, nothing can stop me. It doesn't matter what I do. I mean, it does matter what I do, but I'm not going to be getting sick every time the wind blows. I'm not going to be getting a cold because I already have an army that's powered up. You're literally like multiplying soldiers when you use shaga mushrooms.
mushroom. This will give you extreme resistance to disease and infections by accumulating this within your body on a regular basis. Like disease and infections will have no chance up against your immune system. One of my very favorite things about Shaga mushrooms is its adaptogen properties. Shaga mushrooms are an adaptogen, you guys. It has the ability to aid the body at adapting to different stressors in your in your environment. So if at any time you suffer from telogen effluvium or any type of balding that stems from stress, any type of illnesses or anything that stem from stress, this is a great thing because it is an adaptogen, which means that it kind of lays around dormant in your body until something pops off, right? So you have your, your team that is enabling your immune system to be stronger. It's just making it so your body can deal with stressors. And again, like we talked about when it comes to a disease, a disease first had a trigger and then the trigger led it to inflammation. A lot of times it is different forms of stress to the body, but an adaptogen, something that is an adaptogen makes it so that those stressors never turn into something that can cause anything that will interfere with the natural hair growth cycle or anything or any system that is running in your body right it really makes it so your body is staying on the even key this mushroom is freaking amazing mushroom aka fungi it's the same thing but it don't look nothing like a mushroom balancing your immune response sometimes your immune system could be overreactive or it could be underreactive like maybe your immune system reacts too much like me somebody who has hydronitis, somebody who deals with hydronitis superativa, my immune system is overactive. I have an overactive immune system. So by me ingesting shaga mushrooms, shaga mushrooms, and one more that we're going to talk about in my next video is one of those things that makes it so I'm not getting outbreaks. And the only time I'm getting them is if I'm A, either being dusty and eating too much or B, not on my adaptogen routines. So a regular consumption of shaga mushrooms is going to strengthen your immune system and it is going to trigger your body's different responses to stress. So if you are interested in any of these properties that I've given you today on shaga mushrooms, then make sure you check the links in the description box below to learn more because I've only been able to tackle a couple of things. I like to go a lot deeper. So if you want to learn more about shaga mushroom powder and how you can get your hands on some, then make sure you check the links in the description box below and let me know have you ever tried shaga mushroom tea powder anything before in any type of way and if you have what have been your experiences with them i love you guys so much and until my next video keep your immune system good and stop putting coconut juice and and rice nipple juice and 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 pickle booty juice pickle nipple juice in your hair we're not doing that. Food go in your stomach. Hair products go in your hair. Don't get nobody scared.